Employers across the country are dealing with a shortage of staff and some businesses are only going to need more help going into the holiday season. We had a police investigation and now it's starting to slow down again for an incident. It's happening today, Women's March events across the country, including right here in Washington, D.C. As we approach midterms, organizers say they are marching for reproductive rights. It hadn't happened in a hundred years when a House Speaker didn't win election on the first ballot. Ballot. A hundred years until last week. That's when Representative Kevin McCarthy did win the speakership, but it took five days and 15 votes. This is near Springfield, and you can see in the distance there that accumulation of cars. That is going to be a lot of red for you this morning. You may soon see a slight drop in those gas prices. The White House says it's releasing millions of barrels of oil from strategic reserves in an effort to ease some of the pain consumers are feeling at the pump. Those who live in Hagerstown and other parts of Washington County are reacting to the president's visit. And let's just say it was a mixed reaction. So if you are in Maryland, you're going to be seeing a bit of congestion. Actually, you're going to be seeing it a lot of our region. Take a look at that. We've got it right there near Alexandria.